What's up, Rebels? Welcome back to our channel. Make sure you hit subscribe. Give this video and a like. Merle, come here. My brother is in town visiting Uncle Merle. Our brother. What's up? Our brother. He's my brother now. And we today are going to go to the Enchanted Forest, which is like a hippie, low budget version of Disneyland. I. What? Yeah. It's pretty magical. And it's well, we haven't, way. We it's haven't in the been yet, but we're really excited and have been wanting to go. We've drove past the sign a few times. Mm -hmm. So we have our little Luna dressed to impress with her wand. We've got our capes. And we're wearing capes because we're weirdos. I always wear my cape to amusement parks. And we're drinking a little bit like responsible parents to make it <laughs> even more fun. Having a little wine cooler real quick before we hit the hit the park. I am so excited. This is my favorite thing to do in the world is wear my cape and go to theme parks. Wow, she's a real witch. Look at the, that's the most beautiful witch I've ever seen. <laughs> you dropped your uh, wand, my lady. <laughs> you dropped your wand, my lady. Look. Are you ready to go to go cast spells on the enchanted forest? Lovely. Yes. She seems quite ready. She is quite prepared. I heard the lo the witch loves little children. Oh, is this Shall we is enter? Sweet ones, she like looks you. scared. Yeah. She knows better. She's like, I'm not going in there. You guys, this place is. <laughs> you guys, this place is trippy as hell. Look at this over here. Not, not quite what I would have thought. There's dogs and flowers. This is not what I was expecting. What do you Mary's think? little lamb looks like he doesn't want to be there. What do you think, Luna? Are you okay? Is this a little weird, kind of weird place? It's a lot. It's a lot for a little <laughs> mine. No. Nope. That's impressive. Me, I'm still. You're still learning. Young grasshopper. This place is pretty cool, you guys. It's a bunch of fairy tales that I remember as kids. There's Jack and Jill. It's so cool, and I love that it's like in the forest. It's really, it makes it even that much more magical. Very. She's like freaked out by this place. She doesn't know what to think. <laughs> it's a lot of stimulus. Yeah, in the cave she's like stimulus. Oh. Good job, Luna. Wow. Good job. Woo. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good Digging it. She's smiling. Yeah, she's she's having outbursts of joy. Yeah. It was too much for her. Don't bring your baby on a carousel right after they had a bottle. It's <laughs> too wild for the drunk girl. <gasps> Hi, baby Luna, are you having fun? Are you having so much fun at the park? We just tried to take her on a ride and they said she couldn't go because she isn't wearing shoes. What? What? 
She owns shoes, but we didn't think that we had to bring them anywhere because like baby shoes are really cute, but totally useless if they don't walk. So now we know your baby has to go ride. If your baby wants to ride the little train, she has to bring on her little baby shoes. So silly, loons. So, so silly, huh? What do you think about that? A little bit ridiculous. So next time we go to a theme park, you bet Luna's gonna be wearing her Chucks or her Vans or her dogs. We gotta bust out your shoes now. Apparently they're, they're useful. lot of fun you guys it's pretty small but we may do so of course our next adventure is gonna be eating all right you guys so we are home we're in our pajamas oh I haven't changed yet oh <laughs> we are home and I'm about to give stinky butt over there a little bath me this stinky butt yeah. this stinky butt and this no shoe wearing Crazy Rebel. Oh my gosh, yeah, it was ridiculous. They they took their job so seriously over there. Luna was not able to get on some of the rides because the like manager came up and was like, she can't go on any rides because she doesn't have any shoes. <laughs> and we were like, she's four months old. Like, she doesn't wear shoes. Now we know. <laughs> From now on, I'm going to just keep, because she actually owns shoes, I'm just going to always keep a little pair of shoes in her diaper bag. So next time the Karens try to come for us and say she can't go on something because she doesn't have shoes, I'll be like, actually, here's her shoes. I know. We were like, she has socks and we can carry her, but whatever. But anyways, that was a great day. That was a great first amusement park experience for her. Yeah, I think that was the perfect one for her because we weren't there too long. And it the was The lines small. were like super quick. Yeah, there was like literally no line. And it, and it was all shaded with the forest. And it prepared you. Get ready to go to theme parks the rest of your life, girlfriend. You're going to be a season pass holder. Mommy loves these things. Mm -hmm. And we move into California. Mm -hmm. You be better get ready to go to Disneyland, Universal Studios, all, all of the them, parks. girlfriend. Anyways, thanks for watching. We need to put this little chunker to bed. She's, she's looking a little worn out. <laughs> she had a lot of fun. We had a long day. Yeah. Okay, we love you guys. Bye. Bye.